Hey, it's Heather Joy, and today is September 4th, also known as Beyonce Day. Queen Bee was born on this day in 1981. And I want to share with you a little Beyonce story, which is my favorite celebrity meet cute ever, um, that involves me, my little cousin Wesley, and Miss Beyonce herself. So let's go back almost 20 years to the summer of 2007. I was living and working in New York and my little cousin Wesley, who was from Atlanta, had come to spend the summer with me in Harlem. Someone that I knew had some extra tickets to Total Request Live uh, and offered them to me. And when I found out that the tickets were for the day that was Beyonce was going to perform, I was like, yeah, absolutely, we'll go. So now, this is not like 2024 megastar Beyonce, but she was a bona fide hit maker by this time. She already had like Destiny's Child, and this is also the B-Day era. So, you got Upgrade You. She's had like a, a litany of, of hits at this point. So, I'm excited. Wesley's excited. We go to Midtown to the MTV TRL Studios. And Wesley at this point is like... 13 years old, but he was physically a late bloomer, so he looked to be about eight or nine. But he had the, the outward exterior of a tabby cat, but the interior of a lion. So he's, he's 13 on the inside. So we get to the studio and they tell us that he cannot sit with me because children under the age of 16 are not permitted to be on camera. So they have a VIP section for children. Okay, sounds legit. But as it turns out, the VIP section is really just a de facto kitty section. It's like him and some six and seven year olds in VIP. So he's completely crestfallen. We don't really have much of a choice. We either put him in VIP or kitty land, or we just don't see Beyonce. So with a sulk, he goes down there. And He's sitting there and we're waiting for Beyonce to come on and I'm like kind of looking over to make sure that he's okay. And all of a sudden we get the cue that Beyonce is going to come out onto the stage. So we're waiting with bated breath and Wesley is in the kitty pit trying to, you know, like take one for the team and look like he's okay with everything that's going on. So they cue Beyonce and she starts to walk out. And this is like, you know, 25 year old Beyonce. So the body is bodying, the hair is hairing, all, is doing all the things. And so I see Wesley kind of look over her and he's like, oh, you know, um, and I'm like, oh Lord, this boy is already getting started. Uh, so she's getting ready to walk onto the stage and then they say cut and she pauses. So she pauses and let's say I'm Beyonce. She pauses right next to Wesley. So he is less than like a foot away from her. So she's waiting for her cue to come on and as she's waiting, she looks and he catches her eye. And I see this because I'm looking because I'm like, oh my gosh, she, he's so close to her right now. So she pauses and she looks over at him and she goes, oh my goodness, you are so handsome. And she places her hand on his cheek like this. And then before you know it, the moment is gone and she's onto the stage and she does her performance and it's wonderful and it's great and we all have a wonderful time and we go home. So let's fast forward about an hour and a half. Wesley and I are way on the west side walking to the car dealership to pick up my car. And I notice him kind of caressing the left side of his face. And I'm like, does he have an allergic reaction or something? So I said, Wesley, what is wrong with your face? Are you okay? He goes, I can still feel her hand on my cheek. I think she must have had on some kind of special lotion. I was like, <laughs> I have never felt more like somebody's mama in my life. I was like, boy, quit being silly. She had on some Jergens. And that's it. This was true star power because my girl touched his cheek for all of a half a second. And hours later, he still felt the effect of her special lotion, AKA her nothing. I'm sure she had on some hand lotion, but it was regular hand lotion and he could still feel it. I'm sure today, 20 years later, it's still right there. Happy Beyonce day.